Hey, it's Joe with Joe Lee Farms. Lisa and I are at a very special place today in the barrio of San Jose, which is just outside of Vilcabamba. And it's actually part of Vilcabamba. So we're at a place called Monte Sueños. Monte Sueños is a really unique place. This place was owned by Meredith and her husband, Brian. Brian passed away quite a few years ago before we moved here. Uh, Meredith passed away, I guess, two to three years ago, somewhere in there. And so this is a wonderful place. Meredith is an artist. She's conducted a lot of art classes here. They used to have a lot of people up for different parties and things that went on here. Everybody in the valley got invited to these big parties. And we were invited a couple times. We didn't get to make it. We had other plans. But we are here now, and it is the first time we've been here. It's magnificent. They do rent some uh, rooms here. And uh, we'll have all that information at the end of the video. But as you can see, it's so unique and so wonderful here. There is so much to see. I don't think you can get it all in in one day. There's little things we keep noticing as we walk around. So we're going to attach a bunch of pictures and little video clips onto this. And I hope you'll watch it all the way through. And don't forget, at the end, there's going to be more information. Let's get started. <laughs> Well, I hope that you enjoyed our little tour of Monte Sueños. This is a wonderful resort, wonderful place. And again, this was owned by Meredith and Brian, and they have both passed away. And so this gentleman here to my right, this is Ulysses. Ulysses has been the caretaker here for a very, very long time. How long have you been here, Ulysses? I am here 18 years. 18 working, years. Working, management the place. Wow. So you've seen it all here. Yes, I know every, every so yeah. Meredith and Brian, uh, Brian had a couple kids, and so Ulysses is now a co-owner with the two children they had, and uh, he lives here on this place and takes um, care of it. Yes, in New Jersey. They are living in New Jersey. They're in New Jersey, uh, yes. yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. But you're here on this place. Yes, no, I am living here all the time, here in Montesuenos. Fantastic. So um, Ulysses, what would you like to tell people about this place? Yeah, uh, this is a... Um, Say the people come to visit Vilcabamba, Ecuador, Vilcabamba, visit Montesueños, because the, it's very nice place, beautiful place. The construction is organic, very rustic, very unique here in this area. And also the energy is pure. Yes, yes. And the artwork of Meredith that hangs on the walls here is pretty spectacular. She's quite the artist. Yes, Meredith. 
left good uh, legacy, good example for future buildings here in Vilcabamba. Yeah, yeah. Well, here's the wonderful thing about Monte Sueños is that you can experience this really special place as well. And Ulysses is glad to have you here as a guest. And Ulysses, can you tell our viewers a little bit about the pricing here and what to expect? Yes, we have a good prices, very economic prices here in Monte Sueños. The rooms, a spectacular view, nice, nice view, nice uh, serves here in Monte Sueños. The prices from $35 to $45 single per night. Also for couple is uh, from 60 to 70 dollar couple per night. Mm -hmm. 60 to 70 for a couple per night. Y yes, we have very nice areas that the guests can to visit. Nice hammocks to can to read. Nice view. In different areas for make photography, photography and many activities they can to make here. Right now. For, for meals, would they cook their own meals or? Yes, we have, we include the, the breakfast for, uh, for guests. You include but we breakfast. have the kitchen area if the, the guests like to cook a soup or other meals here. Mm -hmm. So the guests can cook their other meals here, you provide breakfast? Exactly, yes. Perfect, yeah. That's a great way to stay. Now, of course, Vilcabamba is full of restaurants, so you want to experience that. <laughs> yes. I think I counted up to 70 restaurants now in Vilcabamba. That's yes, incredible. we have varied of the meals in Vilcabamba. Yeah, quite a bit to offer there. Yeah, exactly, yeah. And for a few bucks, you can shop at the Mercado and stock up on food and vegetables and bring it back here to this Ex kitchen. Exactly, yes, they can to cook here. And the view here, you'll see from the pictures, Mandango, uh, the famous mountain, is in the, the view here. The mountain is just all the way. This is uh, Garanga over yes, here. Yes, we have the, the, the male mountains. Mandango Mountains, in the female mountains, we have the Waranga Mountains. Waranga right there, yeah. We have beautiful mountains around the, the area. Mountains everywhere. Yes, exactly. Peaceful place. I'm sitting here, I hear no noise. No noise, very quiet. Very, very quiet. Relaxing. Yeah. Lots of butterflies, lots of birds. Lisa got a picture of a, of a hawk flying over while we were here. And yeah, uh, we have a lot of birds here, a lot of insects, a lot of... Insects, a lot of birds, flowers, a lot leaves, yeah. different shape. Mm -hmm. There's so many varieties of plants here. I can't even begin to tell you all of them. And I know a lot about plants, but I don't know all the varieties here. Mm -hmm. But it does have coffee growing here. A lot of different orchids, everything from the Catalea orchid um, on up, all kinds of different orchids. Yes, it's true. We we were collecting different areas in the jungle, little other than my grandfather's lands because it's very Close the Podocarpus area. Oh, yeah. So always we were collecting plants and planting here, make their own gardens. So yes. in relation to Vilcabamba, I mean, the Podocarpus Park is just like right behind us. It's not yes. far at all. So, uh, I think so. Yes, not too much far away. I think so that six or eight hours. At six hours, you can try right the first part to Podocarpus National Park. Yeah, yeah. Mm. So this is a great area to be in. You're going to be fairly close to town. How much is a taxi ride up here? The taxi cost is from the Vilcamba Center to Montesuanos, $3. $3? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So $3 each way, yeah, very reasonable. And, of course, you can walk to town. A lot of people would. And um, it's a um, very walkable distance, even for an old guy like me. Okay, well, folks, I hope that you will give um, Ulysses a call here. I'm going to put his phone number yeah. in the description box below the video so that you can reach out to him. And can you provide an email if they want to email you? Yes, I have an email. So we'll too. get his email mm -hmm. and uh, we'll put that in the description box. So if you want to contact him about reserving a room here at Monte Sueños, Ulysses can help you with that. Um, and he can help you um, arrange any of the touring that you want to do while you're here. You've got people for that, I'm sure. Yes, uh, people welcome. People that you like to call on. Welcome. <laughs> Okay, thanks again, and thank you, Ulysses, for being so gracious and allowing us all to come up here and take yeah. pictures. And, and well, thank uh, you, too, for your help. Well, we, we love to help people. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate it so much. Okay, ciao for now.